Well, welcome to Weekly Wisdom, and what an honor and privilege it is for me to be able to share this week. So here's my question for this week. How fast and how far do you have to run to outrun a lie? Well, God's Word actually gives us the answer to that. This week we're reading from Proverbs uh, chapter 19, and we're looking at verse 5 and verse 9, and I want you to listen to these words. Verse 5 says this, A false witness will not go unpunished, and whoever pours out lies will not go free. That people will be punished. If you tell lies, you'll be punished, and you'll lose your freedom. Verse 9 says this, A false witness will not go unpunished, and whoever pours out lies will perish. There it is. Punishment, you'll lose yourself, you'll cease to exist, is what that word means in Hebrew. And so here's a couple thoughts on that. First is this, speaking falsely and telling lies will eventually catch up to you and crush you, and you won't be happy with the results. The answer to the question I asked earlier is, you can't outrun a lie. And that's what this proverb, these proverbs are reminding us. And also, speaking truthfully allows us to walk in freedom and peace. And we're not worried about what's over our shoulder. We're not looking over our shoulder, worried about a lie catching up to us. And so, Shoreline, here's my challenge this week. I had a three-part challenge for us as we reflect on these two Proverbs. First is, if you have a habit or tendency to speak falsely or to share falsehoods, whether it's uh, speaking in conversations or maybe even sharing things on social media that aren't truthful or aren't trustworthy, Here's my challenge. Number one, recognize it. The practice of speaking falsely or telling lies, it is a dangerous territory to be in. And so I wanna encourage you to recognize it, to not speak falsely. Number two is this, repent of it. If that's your habit, your natural tendency, turn away, run away from it, and run to God and speak truthfully. And finally, remember. Remember who you are in Jesus Christ. If you are a follower of Jesus, remember that you have been called to be a bearer of truth and to bear and share grace. And so we are called to be truth bearers and grace sharers. And so Lord Jesus, that's my prayer. That's our prayer, Lord, that we would refrain from speaking falsely. That Lord, when we have opportunities to share the truth, that we would speak truthfully. And that Lord, knowing that we can't outrun a lie, knowing that speaking falsely and speaking falsehoods will eventually catch up to us. Lord Jesus, we pray that you would call us to speak truth, no matter where we're at and what we're doing, that we would be truth tellers and bearers of truth with others. And we pray this, Jesus, in your name. Amen.